welcome to this video. Yeah, come say hello. Say hello to you. Hi. <laughs> we have missed you guys. It has been a while since we posted something, right, baby? Because we got a new baby. <laughs> We got Corona, the whole family. Uh, my husband Eric, me, and then our au pair Jane. And uh, we have been having like also the flu like symptoms. And we lost taste, we lost smell, and all that. And it has been a couple of days now that I haven't been able to give my babies a kiss. And I'm feeling so bad about it, guys. Like, this is the worst time. To get corona like i got corona like i tested positive two days after i gave birth to my baby boy and um since then we have been walking around all of us here in the house with uh, masks on because the midwife advised us that it is the best thing to do and uh, to protect the kids yeah why are you hiding are you hiding behind the curtains? Yeah. Okay. Where is Kayon? Peekaboo. chances are very rare and that is some something that is really really cool and I was thinking God is really really wonderful because he has made sure to protect his little kids you know because you can imagine if also kids would get the virus like really quickly like the chances I cannot even start imagining because it doesn't feel my body was broken now yeah baby yeah now i am able to talk to you guys like this like i have energy even to speak get too sick 
yeah i was feeling really bad and i was having the flu uh symptoms but i have a feeling that if i didn't get uh vaccinated when i was pregnant then maybe it would have been worse so i would yeah if you ask me um Nemo, what do you think should i get vaccinated now that i'm pregnant if you're pregnant i would say yeah maybe it's better because you never know what might happen like in the future or immediately after you have a baby because for me it has happened uh, immediately after i've had a baby that the covid hit us all of us here yeah obviously apart from the children but it hasn't been the most um easiest week but i'm just very happy that we are almost through this and also that my kids are safe they are healthy the only bad thing that um that i would say is that Kayon is not uh himself anymore Kayon is not sleeping well uh he's not reacting very good to the fact that things have changed and um I think he just needs time and I also need to get better, you know, get stronger because my pelvis and all that, I cannot go downstairs um, as I would want to. Hi, Papa. Actually, uh, I'm not allowed to go downstairs at the moment because my pelvis needs to heal and that needs time. So I miss being back to normal with my family and taking care of Kayon and our new boy as well and my husband he's like he's over there and he's like showing himself like taking care of my husband as well I miss that guy so much and um, this COVID thing is not, is not ideal I wouldn't wish this for anybody so try to protect yourselves, try to keep safe, try to follow the rules the way we are saying. Uh, for us, we, in, we, we don't know where we got it, but we have a feeling because we had a friend over who um, came for dinner. And um, days later, he was positive. So we are thinking maybe we got it from there. It could be from anywhere, maybe at the supermarket also but just try to be safe especially if you're pregnant i would say to you the last weeks of your pregnancy try to follow that baby see you later okay and have you so committed to last who last sydney Yeah, Kayon will so much in eight, eh? Yeah, he's got in the auto slaap. He's got in slaap, but he can't make it. Okay. Dada! You can't make it, man. It is really not ideal to be catching COVID when you are in your... <laughs> when you just... When you have given birth, guys, because the feeling is terrible. But anyway, we are through it. I mean, I'm sitting here, I'm laughing and I'm like, I have some energy and I'm really grateful about that. So I thought, let me come and speak to you guys. And uh, I miss you guys. I have really a beautiful story to tell you about the birth of this one. I need to introduce him to you guys. I need to tell him. I need to tell you his name. Some of you already know. If you know his name already, don't write it down. I need to, you know let it be interesting okay <laughs> so i need to share things with you guys there's a lot a lot that i want to tell you about the birth story i want to share the video with you guys you know the birth happened here in our bed or is it on our bed <laughs> right here when we were planning to go to the hospital you know it's very weird it's very like i don't want to say weird but it's amazing how we humans we think we know very well and we are planning things and then god says no it's not the way you want it is the way i want it because you see with Kayon, we were planning for a home bath it turned out to be a hospital bath with this one we were planning a hospital bath it turned out to be a home bath you know <laughs> 
very it's very funny if you're new here you haven't subscribed i don't know what you're waiting for <laughs> so hit that subscribe button guys join the family and thank you to you guys who have always been here for us like let's continue this journey together i'm looking forward to hearing from you in the comment section i love reading from you guys and to know that you're there okay uh don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll catch you in the next video and hopefully without this these things that's why i'm shouting i'm feeling like you cannot hear me because of the masks bye bye